be one of the offbeat predator variations. I like seeing that, or at least speculate. Round one. Five. All right. Uh, here we go. Champs are going in early. Both of these boys going in early. I like seeing it. All right. We got mid-screen pressure coming from both players. Smart disc in effect. No advantage being taken right now from Cyclone. I know he had that Warrior Predator on tap, but here comes. All right, here we go. This Killer Leatherface. We all know what happens when Killer gets to that one. Uh, oh, 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 wait, we got dropped. We got lag. We got all kinds of shit happening right now. We got Berserker stands canceled. Tossed in the corner. Slashes his throat. Let's see Mo. Big overhead. I think these players are trying to feel out the environment right now because at this point, you know, I can definitely see and taste the lag. There's the big boot. All right, looks like Cyclone's finally made it. Uh-oh, uh-oh. The sacrifice is in place. Oh, wow, nice. Here we go, nice breaker. Oh, Berserker Sense makes the mark, but no meter to extend the combo. Uh, does it? Oh, wow. Taking his turn back right there in the nick of time is Cyclone. Oh, with the smart disc with the knockdown. Got the Oki! Will this chip do it? Yes! The chip! Alright, here we go. Lot of pressure coming right there. Ooh, big opening right there from Champster. Champster's in a lot of trouble right here in this game. A lot of pressure coming right here from Cyclone. Now, Warrior, now, whenever you see Predator, I mean, Warrior's got a lot of dirty stuff. It's him. Cyclone's gonna go up this first game. Nicely done. Now, Cyclone. Predator wins. Now, Cyclone. You know, he's just going right on in with that safe Predator pressure right here in Warrior. For a lot of years, everybody was just, whenever you thought of Predator, you think of his Q10. You know, you think of HQT with all the, the pressure shenanigans you've got right there, the cancels, and the, the juicy bits you get right there with the with the arm cannons. But then you go into Warrior, which was not quite as explored as, uh, as uh, HQT. And you know you got a lot of really cool stuff in there. You got a lot of uh, of uh, safe pressure. You got obviously you know a lot of the universal normals that allows him to play a really good neutral game like down four, and uh, and uh, his little shoulder tackle that he's got that keeps him safe. All right, here we go. Just like that right there. That that move right there. That is a quick armored, uh, safe armored uh, special that allows him to really either extend his pressure or just keep you guessing right there at close range. A nice interactable from Chancer. And he's on the move. Nice slow saying so. Alright, nice down four. Alright, here comes. Oh wow. Dude, taking his turn back is Chancer. And this time he has the resource to burn. Will Cyclone break out of this? No, looks like he's gonna hold that. Oh, nice backdash to get away from the cancel pressure. Oh, nice take. These boys are striking taking their turns back right now. Woo! Down four into the low chainsaw, and a berserker stance hits! But Chester did not have any resources. Oh, and that's gonna be, yeah, he's gonna spend it. He had no choice. He had no choice but to spend that. None whatsoever, he had to do that. Yeah, man, this is one of the few Predator variations that Predator can actually wake up and get up off the ground without actually having to worry about the armored launcher. A change that was made in the last update of the game. Nice down. Down three, man. These boys are just going straight in. I love Sin. Woo! Big cancel right there. A lot of respect. Smart disc, no avail. Oh, wow. No, no more resources for Cyclone. Safe overhead. All right, here we go. Oh, man. Both of these boys swinging for the fences right now. But Chamster, he's got to find some way to get on the board. Oh, big overhead right there. And that's going to put Cyclone up 2-0. Woo, quick 2-0 right now for Cyclone. Predator wins. This matchup is very interesting to commentate because of the fact that both of these characters are made to just do one thing and one thing only. And that's just get in and cause chaos. 
in both you're seeing the result right now although cyclones gotten the better of uh champs to right now i think both of them are aggravated to the uh the online environment that they're in right now it looks like that second match was a lot cleaner than what we saw in the first match but here we go let's see what happens now in game number three yeah man i, I agree sacred carrot man these boys are straight up saying yo i ain't holding Round nothing one. Pressure plus frames, fuck all of that shit. I ain't holding it. Armor, what the fuck is that? Oh wow, Cyclone was making the read of all reads right there. Oh, oh, mashing on Leatherface when he's got a resource. That's a game of death. Bop, bop, bop. Yar, 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 yar. Oh man, Tamsin went for max damage right there, getting that forty percent. Oh, big overhead with that back too. Try going for the unblockable, no dice. Oh, down one for circumstance. Here we go. Will Cyclone break this? Nah, he's gonna eat this. Oh wow, big knockdown combo. And Cyclone burned a bar right there. Very ill advised. Oh, change mark. Oh no. A big drop combo from Cyclone, man. Yo. Yo, that was crazy. Another Berserker charge right now from Ch Oh man, these boys don't care! I love it! Yar! Here we go, Smart Disc. I wonder if the Berserker stands uh, charge right there could actually go through the Smart Disc. Like, oh, here we go. Big conversion. Yeah, he's gonna have the bar to burn. Uh uh. Sits him down. Is he gonna go for mi Oh, he went for a mix up right there, running mix. And he's gonna pay for that. Oh, he's gonna pay for it. Oh, nice low saw. All right, no more interactable. Oh, what? Down two from hell! Yo! Man, these boys don't give a shit! Pay your respect. Like, dude, these boys are swinging in ways that I'm just like, yo! I, I wish I could get away with this when I play. <laughs> Dude, I couldn't get away with none of this if I tried. Not that I'd ever want to try, because holy crap, by the book, you should never be getting away with some of the things that these boys are doing up close. But, hey, man, it's entertaining, and that's all I can say. Yo, man, I hope you guys are enjoying this as much as I am, because this is something. Now, right, here we go. Down three into the charge right there. Oh, I'm right in his face with the Berserker charge. Oh, missing his combo is Tamsin, that's rare. Oh! Berserker stance says no to the interactable. Act 2 says no to the, to the smartness. Man, these boys just do not care right now. They are swinging for everything imaginable. All right, getting his turn back in Cyclone. Stuff with the Berserker stance, Cyclone. Getting a big combo going in Cyclone. Corner advantage in Cyclone, dropping his combo in Cyclone. Regaining his turn in Cyclone. Chance to trying to escape. Oh, well, here we go. Smart disc in effect. Cyclone just trying to get distance. Big boot, no dice. Oh, he could have had a punish right there. Misses his chance, but armors and gets the round. That's all that matters. Round two, fight. Oh, Berserker stands right on in his face. And he's gonna burn the resources. We got a lot of lag right now. Yeah, champs are forced to really just shorten his menu right there. Whoa, man, that's unfortunate right there. Yeah, a lot of lag interfered right there with that sequence, and that really kept champs from getting the full extent of what he could have had. These boys are swinging for everything right now. Big win bonus right there from champs. And he's gonna burn the bar. At least make Cyclone break. Oh, he could have had him. He was trying to bait that breaker right there. All right, just like that, Cyclone's regained some control. Air corner position. Big down two right there. Oh, Tams is gonna go right on in with the Berkerson, and that is going to work. Fire, All right, fire, man. Corner advantage right now for Champster. 
That's down four right there. And these boys trying to find their strike. Oh, wow. Cyclone had a major opportunity right there with that smart disc. And right now, he's coming down with those overheads. He's coming down with those airborne overheads. Those are nice. Uh, getting his turn back all the time after that shoulder tackle is chapter. He's not letting any of that fly. That's one of the few times you'll see him getting hit with that armor. And this time, Cyclone doesn't have any armor. And now Cyclone's getting hit with the full extent of this. Sending him down chain sparks, yes. And this time he gets the run up grab he's been looking for. Slashes his throat. Oh wow, I thought that was gonna connect for a moment. Oh, missing his jump in, it's Champster. Nice anti-air from Champster. No more resources from Cyclone, he's gotta do this the hard way. Oh wow, getting him with the last part of that sequence! And he's gonna have some juicy frame advantage. Oh wow! Frame advantage city! <laughs> Yo, Champster ties it up by giving Cyclone a taste of his own medicine with the oppression. I'm loving it. Nothing but oppression, oppression, oppression. That is all we are seeing right now. Oh boy, here we go. Cyclone going right to the tried and true with the Jason Voorhees. The tried and true with the Jason Voorhees. Let's see what happens. Going with that relentless Jason. I'm very curious to see how this matchup goes down. The horror icons facing off. Imagine at the beginning of Mortal Kombat X's life, or at the beginning of Mortal Kombat's revival, you'd see Jason versus Leatherface in a Mortal Kombat game. Could anybody have possibly imagined that shit? All right, looks like the connection's starting to stabilize a little bit just as I say that, and to drops his combo. But instead, he still has a lot of momentum going on right now. Cyclone trying to get his stride back, and he does with the command grab. Oh, here we go. Tick throw city. Snaps his neck, tosses him away. Oh, wow, here we go. Yeah, as we all know, Champs is not afraid to take his turn. Oh, a lot of lag. I hope he gets his combo. He does not. He drops it. A lot of lag interfered right there. I'm just going to try to fill out the environment a little bit. Looks like they're moving again. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, boy. A lot of lag right there, man. I can see every single frame right there. Nightmare. Round two. Who, who am I feeding you? Well, you ought to know who you're being fed. I think I messaged you about it, bro, bro. You have the beautiful privilege of taking on Forever Elite tonight. You're taking on the homie Forever Elite. Oh, yeah, man. This is going to be one hell of a main event tonight. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Oh, here we go. Champs are imposing his will right now, but not for long. Not for long. Not with command grabs like that. Getting tossed into the corner. What? Down to wait. What? Champster, you gotta stop. Champster, you gotta stop. Champster, you gotta stop. Round fight. Like what the fuck am I looking at? This man champs to taking his turn on every little thing. Oh, here we go. Oh, here we go. Big time opening right there from champs. All right. No resources from Cyclone to get out of it yet. Uh, but then again, you don't need it whenever he drops his combo like that. Wait, what kind of combo was that? Oh, I've never seen that combo before. Too bad he dropped it. And it's especially too bad because champs has got his turn back. But he drops his combo. Oh, wow. Here we go. The battle of drops, man. I need to start seeing a little bit more ch clutch and a little bit less choke from both of y'all. Oh, that's gonna do it right there. Oh my God, bro. 
This man, Cyclone, obliges exactly what I was looking for in having a little bit less choke, a tiny little bit less choke, and having a, being a little bit more clutch. Less choke, more clutch, boys. Hey, let's go now. Let's go now. Let's see what's up. Round one. Fight. Oh my god, I think I found my new stick. Uh oh, here we go. Pursuit was about to be active, but not for long. Right, here we go. For circus set. Alright, here we go. Alright, knocks it out again. For boot. The boot. Here we go. Big combo. Oh wow, he misses his combo in the corner. The boot. Man, Cyclone's just imposing his will right now in this game so far. And just knows when to take his turn right on back. Oh wow, get getting hit this time. Oh man, these boys just go. Oh, Alright, here we go. The armor eater, and there it is! Not much you can do at the end of a game when that's active. Alright, let's see what happens. Fight. See if Champster can adjust to this. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh, the interactable ruins the hype. Oh, wow. Here we go. Here comes Cyclone. Takes his turn back. Cyclone uh, meticulously walking Champster right down in the corner. So far for most of this set, Cyclone's had corner advantage. Doesn't matter what matchup it's been so far. Oh, and speaking of which, man, look at this pressure sequence right now. Right, here we go. Getting a nice four star chance to give himself some breathing room. All right, here we go. He scouted that teleport beautifully. Yo, you can't scout that teleport any better than what he just did. And he gets him with the overhead. Oh my God, man, Champster. He's like, yo, you want to see some oppression? I got oppression for you. Wow, Champ. Wow, Cyclone broke that combo. Oh, he got the. He's got a corner combo going right now. It could pay off in his favor. Oh, and the boot. The boot. Jesus. The boot. Pay your respects. Oh my god, man. This dude, Cyclone, gave Champster the most disrespectful helping of soul leather that I've ever seen somebody dole out for the win. Like, dude, straight up say, eat my boot, you will enjoy it, because you got no choice. And Champster just put the bib around his chest and said, I'm ready for a three-course meal. One, Let's see what happens. <laughs> Let's see what happens. Champster's like, yo, I ain't abused, bro. We going in with some chain sparks. Oh, it's all blockable? Oh yeah, he gets that unblockable. He's like, yo, I'm starting this shit off like a bat out of hell. All right, here we go. Cyclone's now got corner advantage again. All right, now try to go for the circuit slash again is uh, champion, but no avail. Yo, what's up, Darky? Yo, Darky, I'm glad you're here. I'm glad you're here, cause take a while guessing who you're playing tonight. Take a guess at who your opponent is. Uh, as we see a backbreaker. Man, right now, Champster, he's got to find a way to minimize some of this corner pressure. Right now, it seems like most of this set has been spent in the corner with Champster trying to fight his way on out of it. Right now, he's off to a good start. He was off to a good start in the first round as well when he got off to a 40 round. Uh, sorry, that's a 48. Plus a throw. That's a 60% sequence. Yes, please. Man, this poor. Oh, wow. Is he going to convert off this? Oh, not quite. Not quite. He, tra he, tra he tried his best. Down four into the, uh, the Berserker Slash, man. And the chance to try to go in with that Berserker stand, and he gets the W for this round. He gets the W. Darky, you get to go up against Min List. You get to go up against the lovely Min List. Hope you're ready. Uh oh, here we go. Oh, 
Oh, wow. How you get grabbed out of your own pursuit, bro? You can't let that happen. Here we go. Flashing him up his champster. Finally putting Cyclone in the corner. Oh, dropping his combo. That's big. All right, here we go. Champster's got the bar to burn. He's going to do that. Is, is Cyclone going to break? No, he's not. Right, here we go. Oh, he tried to back dash. Champster does that. He doesn't use the bar. Oh, Champster can pay for that. Oh, Champster can pay for that. Oh, dude. You should never have let him have those resources. Oh, but he's going to escape by the skin of his teeth. This man, Champster. Oh, my God, Champster. This man, Champster. Leatherface wins. Oh, you can't be doing that shit. You can't be doing that shit, bro. Bro. All you're doing There's is just leaving team. the door wide open for this man to just blow this set wide open when you just let him have opportunities like that. All right, Chancellor should not have won that game, but he wound up taking it in spite of dropping that pivotal combo because he didn't want Cyclone to break. That's sometimes when you play mind games and you play yourself. I mean, Khaled said it best, bro. Congratulations, you played Round yourself, one. but in this Fight. case, Champster actually lives to see the light of another W. All right, let's see what happens. Four to three in Cyclone's favor. Let's see how this winds up. Cyclone once again pressing into the corner, getting corner advantage. Champster trying to fight his way on out. At this point, I'm starting to wonder if Champster just comfortable with me. Because we spent most of this set with him trying to fight his way on out of that left corner. The left side of the screen. Here he's got a nice little sequence going. He's got a juicy frame advantage. Oh, he thought he had to confirm. He's going to pay. He's going to lose out on that. Oh, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Tossed in the corner. Uh oh, here we go. Oh. Just like that, man. Round two. Cyclone Fight. regaining all the moments. Oh, wow! Cyclone really challenged that. He actually thought Champion was just going to uh, cancel it and not let it rip. That's an interesting combo. All right, here we go. Low chainsaw for the win. Oh, wow. He smashes right out of that berserker stance. Gets the, he wants that tick throw, and he finally gets the tick throw. Puts him in the corner. Once again, Champion's going to have to fight his way on out of it. Oh, we got four bear hugs. Snaps his neck. Tosses him back in the corner. Right, oh, oh, wow. If he had just let that berserker stance go, that shit would have definitely done the trick. Oh, boy. That was a bad thing to do. Here we go. We got we got armor Jason. Let him go to sleep. Is he going to go to sleep? Yes, he's going to sleep. And Cyclone has no resources to get out of this. Now, he's got to hold all of this. And finally, Champster actually winds up finishing his play. All you right, will learn man. respect. This is super entertaining. Yo, Breezy, thank you so much for the follow, good sir. Thank you so much, man. I hope you're enjoying the stream. This is a good first opening set, man. Bop, 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 bop. Here we go. Oh, the armor. The armor. Here we go. Oh no, that's gonna go against Champster. The boot, more boot. This is for Champster to try and equalize this set at four games apiece. Cyclone wants to go up five to three. He wants to pull away. He doesn't want to be in a dog fight right now against Champster. He wants this to end right here and now. Oh, here we go. That, oh, here we go. Oh man, Champster regaining the, or no, Cyclone regaining the advantage. That's gonna be it, yes it is. Yes, it is, man. Cyclone. Jason well, Darky led you into the right spot, Breezy. Pay your respect. Darky led you into the right spot, man. Yo, thank there you for tuning in. We got one hell of a set starting us off as Cyclone goes up five to three. And right now, man, Jason this is just Boyd. an all-out yes. slugfest. This is just an all-out 
I'm who's going to get in whose face and stay in whoever else's face until this set reaches 10. And right now, Champster going to the Jax pick. It's time to clobber, folks, bro. It's time to clobber, folks. Fight. Let's do this. All right, we got Wrestler Jax up in here. He's like, yo, you want tick throws? I got tick throws. Uh oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh boy, armor on armor, and Jax is gonna lose out on that. Oh, here we go. Oh well, he found the button on the first try. All right, get tossed. Is he gonna get tossed to the left corner? Yes, he is. Oh wow, if he had let that rip, he'd have had a, the opportunity to end this round. But he's still in a great position to cycle. Both in this game and in the set. And feeds Champster another boot. Yo, if there's a dish anywhere in the world that's in the shape of a boot, I'm pretty sure at this point, Champster has just got that shit on lock as his go-to meal, no matter where in the hell he's going to be. Because he is eating that shit as if it's an all-you-can-eat buffet right now, courtesy of Chef Jason Voorhees. Get some says Jax. Bop, bop, bop. Oh, it doesn't convert the corner. Right now, Chancellor, he's got a slight lead, but that can, oh, wow. Down four into the overhead dash. i seen it all. Bro, i seen it all. I've seen it all, like, bro. This man did down four overhead dash punch. I ain't never seen that in my life. I have never seen that in my life. Gotcha. That is crazy. Gotcha. Gotcha. Oh. oh. Rest. Oh, down for it. That one, that one. Oh, he's gonna complete it. Oh, he tried to go for the grab. Oh, he's gonna get the throw. And Tamster puts another one on the board. The switch pays off right now. The switch paid off bigly right there for Tamster. He needed that. He needed that in a big way right there. Yo, how's the stream quality for everybody? Is the stream looking good for everybody? Yo, let me know. Man, we have, because, you know, right now we, we got too juicy of sets going on right now in order for us to be hindered by lag or any other shit. All right, it's running great. That's good to know. Let me see Round here. one, fight. Welcome into the stream. Oh, we got Shinnok, boys. We got Bone Shaper Shinnok. Oh, boy, y'all already know what's coming. If y'all are if y'all are regulars in the stream, I see Bone Shaper Shinnok. You know what's coming if he gets going. You know what's coming. Oh, wow. Here we go. That's much. Lock. Oh, here we go. Knocked him out with the... Uh, come here, foot. Oh, uh, Dark Beam. Uh, <laughs> let's see it. Dark Beam. Hell's Marks. Box. Oh, misses it. Recap. It's the health bar. Unlockable misses. Oh, down for overhead again. This man, Champster, is throwing caution into the wall. The shoulder gets him. Round two. Shoulder gets him. Quality's good, man. That's good to hear. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. These boys are traded. That's a, that was a dash punch trading with a shoulder charge right there, folks. These boys are swinging. Oh, wow. Here we go. We got a ground pound. Bop, bop, bop. Bop, 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 bop. Bop, bop. Mm -hmm. Shit, you ain't bad. Oh, man. This man Chancellor going for the optimal optimal. I love seeing it. And I love seeing him giving him a return of the boot. Final round. I love this color that he's got going on. Regular Jackson costume right now. Bop. Uh, 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 uh. Woo! This man, Champster's hungry! 
Oh, here we go. Dog beep! That was smart. Uh, dog beep! Oh, 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 oh. This man is going right in. Dog beep! Dog beep! Did you get a brutality? No, he was not brutality. That bites. That bites. But nevertheless, Cyclone recapturing momentum. It's very interesting seeing the kinds of mind games that's going on right now at the character select screen too, folks. Because as you can see, obviously, uh, seems like every single time one of these boys captures momentum here in the later stages of this set, a new character, the other one is just like, yo, I got another new character myself. Yo, I'm not going to let you get too comfortable <laughs> in this. But right now, this is a very entertaining start to the night, man. This is a very entertaining. This is Friday Mortal Kombat Exhibition Showcase, folks. Normally we run this on Saturdays, but now that I'm seeing just exactly what we're pulling in right now on this Friday night, should I turn Friday into the new Saturday? It's Friday night becoming the new Saturday night for the Mortal Kombat ex ex Exhibition Showcase here on Twitch.tv forward slash Star Charger 28. One way or the other. Hope you guys are enjoying. I'm glad you all are here. If you're brand new to the stream, remember to like, follow, subscribe to the stream. It's September. You get access to all the beautiful new emotes we got put in the stream. Take advantage of that right now at a discounted price. We got all kinds of foosies going on right now. Down for Health Sparks, the ultimate foosies. Oh, uh, that energy wave of that. Man, he is missing that in a big way. It's more Combat 11. We're not going to do We're enjoying it PX right now. We're enjoying the good stuff. Nice down to right there for Cyclone. Dog beat! Bop, bop, bop! Cyclone's really content with just letting his own do the talking, man. Oh, no, just, I say that. He goes right on in. Dog beat! Hell Sparks on the overhead dash punch with the punish. Dun, dun, doom, doom, yar! Oh, go wow, that was a very late catch. Like, what the hell? That thing snapped him right when he was over to Jax's head. Oh, it's a major pain. Woo, these boys are swinging. Final round, fight. Like, bro, this is madness. He's got the homie Redox reactions up in the stream. So we got Dark Beam up in here. We got recaps. We got down four. Hell Sparks, we got Energy Wave, Dash Punch. Dark Beam, Dark Beam! <laughs> oh no, oh here we go, Dark Beam! Dark Beam! Oh right, here we go, those boys taking their turns back. Woo, we got a X-Ray! Yeah, back during the era where you actually had to spin some shit for your X-Ray. Here we go. Oh! Oh! What? Oh boy. Here we go. This man gets the brutality. What? Samster. Samster coming through in the clutch. Samster hungry. Your respect. Yo, Samster just straight up got in and stole that shit after he popped the x-ray like yo what Gorgon. that was godlike <laughs> See that? and we got goro coming up in here yo let's go let's go Let's go. <laughs> Yo, man, if this shit is setting the tone for the night, I think we might be in store for the greatest episode of the exhibition showcase there's ever been. We got these boys going toe to toe. Next up, we're gonna have Midlist versus Ahegao Darky. And then we've got our main event of the evening, Best Nightmare versus Forever Fucking Elite. Like, holy shit. Shit, what a night! Oh my god. Sacred Karen, man. We might have to explore that for a future episode, man. Let these two just run a first to death and just see who tires out first. 
<laughs> we might have to actually do that shit. We just might. But for right now, let's just enjoy it. Let's just live in the moment. Because this is one this is one for the ages right here. Alright, here we go. This Goro. We're seeing great character variety. This is what the showcase is all about. We're seeing just about everything the game can throw at you. Alright, here we go. Champs are finally getting some momentum back. This is his combo. Getting some juicy frame advantages right now. It's cycling. Here we go. We got nice tick throws right here for Champs. Champs is like, yo, I got tick throws. I got those. And I got this break. Down one, down one. Goro's down one, one of the better down ones in the game. Oh yeah, that plus nine, bro. You can't, oh boy. A nice reversal from Champster with the command grab. Dude, these boys are just flat out going in. Dude, I, I, I welcome a mirror match at this point. I gotta wonder what characters these guys even have in common. I don't even know what characters these guys have in common. All I know is this. They treated us to the best stream opener we've had since possibly the King Gambler versus uh, Emperor Turkey and Hidden Killers versus Pros this summer. Yo! Dude, he paid him back with interest with that stomp brutality. I didn't see that shit coming at all. Damn, I didn't see that coming. The stomp brutality says, yo, we in here. And this man, Snip's coming up in here. Yo, what's up, Snip? Yo, we got Gora, 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 Gora. I remember doing that. Carl Weathers Jax? We gonna Carl Weathers Jax? All right, now. Now it looks like we are playing another mind game here at the character select screen. What's going on here? What is going on here? We got some gamesmanship going on. Sacred Carrot, man. From what I understand, you're not the only one up in here who's doing some studying or doing something school related with regards to catching the stream tonight, enjoying some Mortal Kombat X, and checking out this action, man. Your game glitched. Your game glitch? What you mean your game glitch? Round one. Fight. Man, if he lost, if Chancer had lost that, he said in the chat that his game glitch. And if he was, if he lost out on this due to the fact that his game glitch. That would rob us of so much action. And he is going in right now. He is going in with this Carl Weathers heavy weapons jazz. I respect it. Oh, here we go. We got a lot of damage coming right over here from Cyclone. What's going to happen? Oh, here we go. Oh, it just, oh, wow. Oh, we got down three cancel and a down three for the win. Down three, cancel into down three, like what? I have never seen that. Especially with not nerf heavy weapons jacks. I think we all remember when heavy weapons used to be the unit. I mean, heavy weapons are still decent, but at the same time, it's nothing like what it was when the game was in its prime. I'll tell you what, man, the greatest injustice ever that was ever done to Mortal Kombat was this version of the game not being branded in Evo. 
this version of the game absolutely deserved an Evo. Absolutely. I mean, granted, we've seen what's become of, you know, how things have gone with Evo now. But at the same time, the fact that this version of the game wasn't given as long of a chance to shine as the absolutely busted as shit version is a crime. An absolute crime as we got Big Goro pressure coming up in this corner with Cyclone being the aggressor right now. We got big pressure. He's like, no, dude, you ain't jumping out of here. You holding this shit. Oh, wow. Can't get his combo. Champster. Oh, he gets the. Oh, he doesn't get the full extent of that cancel. This is coming down to the wire. Just like, oh, boy. That could be big. The ground pound for Champster. Like, yo. The ground pound from Jax Champster wins. seals the game. And just like that, Pay it's 7-6. It seems like now these guys are just trying, Cyclone's trying to distance himself slowly game. but surely away from Champster. But Champster's like, nah, bro, you ain't leaving me in the dust. You ain't leaving me behind like that. No, not gonna happen. Yeah, I agree, man. That's Jax. because the Skullgirls community believed in that shit and they kept it going. They kept that shit going. I mean, a part of that is the fact that obviously they knew Lab Zero being the small studio that it was, they weren't just going to keep pumping out games for them every couple of years. So them keep getting behind that shit and keeping it going Round while also one. having a developer Fight. that continued to, to uh, fix that shit, you know, shit was really out of line. I mean, that really helped. I mean, meanwhile, you know, we're dealing with all kinds of radio silence right now from NRS with regards to the new hotness that dropped just last year, but we're not getting into that right now. We're enjoying some Mortal Kombat X as we see Displacer Raiden make his first appearance here in the exhibition showcase. I think this is the first time. Yeah, I've, yeah, this is the first time uh, Displacer Raiden. Oh, slapping him down with the back two, two, back two, two. Oh, here we go. Oh, oh, we got ground pound. What in his face? This man, Samster, has no fear. No fear. Oh, boy, look at this. Immediately coming out with the Superman. Dude, all right. We're set, we're set back. Oh, that's a big time. Oh, no, conversion. Had a big opening right there with the overhead combo. That could have been a lot of damage. All right. Uh-oh. That's a lot of recovery. But damn, Champster does not go full force with the conversion. Oh, wow. He, he actually used up all of his meter right there. He could have definitely had an X-ray at some given point. But instead, it does not matter. We have a tied ball game, folks. We have a tied ball game. Champster's reset the bracket. Reset, baby! Reset! Not quite, not really. He just tied the set. But you see where I'm going with this. It is seven to seven. We wouldn't have wanted this any other way. What a beautiful way to start off tonight's exhibition showcase. Friday night, Mortal yes. Kombat X exhibition showcase, the first one ever. I am so happy to be bringing it to you as we look like we're going to have Ferator coming into the mix right now for Cyclone as we're going to see who can clinch these next three games or possibly next five games out over the other. At this point, I think it's just going to be who's going to be choking less, who's going to have that tiny little bit more clutch. Wow, that's an interesting sequence right there. He's going right underneath that dash button. We got, finally got a cancel combo from Champster. They're not quite as potent as they used to be, but they're still damn good if you can get them. Missing his combo is Cyclone. That down one. I can't forget about that from Ferator. Ferator's got that down one, that beautiful neutral jump punch. Well, beautiful and a uh, very relative sense. But we got this damage. Look at this. That was going to be some of the most monstrous damage in the game. I ought to know. I'll never forget the day Bile has hit me with 75% in tournament. He hit me with 75% ruthless uh, combo in tournament. That shit was the biggest what the fuck I've ever experienced against Ferator. Oh, wow. We got overhead. We got champs to rocking and rolling right now trying to equalize this game. And he does. Oh, wow. Waking up, getting out of the corner. That was just all about getting up out of the corner. Jet, uh, Cyclone might lose this round, but he was like, yo, I'm not losing it in this corner. Oh, 
here we go. Big pressure right here. He's saying you will not mash on me. Big combo. Oh wow, missing the ender, and that gives champs to the opportunity to wake up and tie it up. Yo, this is madness. This here be madness. <laughs> oh, this is madness. This is madness. Big throw right there from Cyclone. Four two two gets thrown out of. Oh, the bop, the big kabosh. We got the heavy weapons doing its work with the rocket launcher. Oh wow, big breaker right there. He had no choice. Oh wow, he's gotta get in now. Anytime you toss Pharaoh away, you gotta. Oh wow, here we go. We got rolling a few, a little bit of damage away. He's got no more Pharaoh. Oh, one 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 takes it for Cyclone. This man just straight up went in. Just said one 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 one. Straight binary code, folks. There is a new case. Straight binary code, except we're just using the second digit. Nevertheless, Scorpion. Cyclone with the Heritage. big kibosh Leather right there face. to end it. As we look like we're gonna go full circle, we're going right back to Leatherface, except this time we're bringing Butcher into the equation. All right, let's see what we're gonna do here. We're bringing Leatherface right back into the equation. Round one, fight. Crazy as hell. All right, here we go. One, two, one, two. As Darky is saying. Thanks for the correction, Darky. Boom! 44%, I don't even think he was done. All right, here we go. Now remember, he's got that mallet smash. And Leatherface, if you thought his mix in Killer was crazy, his mix in this shit is absolutely fucking ludicrous. You let this character touch you while he's in Butcher, your shit will never, your turn will never come back. Tell you what, man, facing a good Butcher is one of the scariest experiences you can have in this game. Butcher is like the closest thing to what you'd have with version 1 MKX when it was literally all about unreactable, oppressive mix, Oki, and everything above. And speaking of oppression, man, Cyclone is just like, yo, I'm just going in. I'm just going in. Pay your respect. Cyclone don't give a shit what's plus, what's armored. He's just going oh, in at this defense. point, and he's trying to close this out. He is now up 9-7 to seven after Champs just spent so much effort getting it tied up 7-7 seven to seven a few moments ago. A few moments ago, we were sitting on a tied ball game thinking we were going to get treated to a straight dog fight to the finish. We very well might still have that in store because Champs has just gone back to the tried and true killer Leatherface, and we're about to see Leatherface versus Ferator to end this stream. Not to end this stream, I'm sorry. To end this set, I'm sorry. We're not ending this stream after this. We're not ending the stream after this. We got hype-ass matches one, coming up after five. this. We got Men List versus Ahagao Darky coming up next. Then we got our main event of the evening. We got our main event of the evening going with Forever Elite versus Best Nightmare. I mean, damn, dude, this is one hell of an appetizer. Is that, are, are those tea bags I was seeing from Cyclone? Were those real tea bags I was seeing from my dude? Or was he really, or was he just buffering something that was just preemptive? I don't know, but nevertheless, he is. He is straight tea bagging! This man is really tea bagging right now! I see you, uh, Cyclone. You are not slick. You are not slick. I see those bags. This man is turning into Sergeant Lipton before our eyes. As Champster's back is once again in the corner, which has been like the, the moral of this set so far. And Cyclone is just smelling blood. He's like, yo, bro, I'm straight going in. I don't care. I'm close to victory. Oh, wow, here we go. Now, right to the berserker stand. Find the chance to get the opportunity he's been looking for. Oh wow, he catches the back dash. Wow, 
by a nice back throw right there. Chandler. Now Cyclone is sitting on X-Ray. Are we going to see that shit? Oh, man just runs right at him while he's sitting on full X-Ray. This man was sitting on full X-ray, and Chamster did not fucking care. He just ran and grabbed his shit and said, I'm gonna grab your ass. I don't care. I love that. You know, when people's, when people's uh, set lives or tournament lives are on the line, you get to see what they're really made of. Oh, look at this shit. He wasn't even close to being done with that combo, bro. That was gonna legit be the 75% combo that Bio hasn't hit me with years ago. Oh, here we go. We got ourselves unblockable. Cyclone's got a lot of meter right now. Oh, wow. Speaking of a lot of meter, Champ just got some resources himself. A lot of frame advantage. Oh, wow. We got a lot of mix. And just like that, Champster forcing Cyclone off of his shit. Oh, oh, no. It's over. Champster put himself in a horrible position right there at the end, and Cyclone is going to take the first set of the night, 10 to 7. Yo, beautiful work, you two. Beautiful work, man. Yo, that was great. That